Clayton, it's so good to see you. Congratulations on the race today. Thank you, thank you. Tell me a little bit about the heat though. Yeah, it was hot and humid out there, but you know, I did a lot of preparation for this race. I've always competed well in the heat and humidity, so it felt good to capitalize on that, and uh, I felt great all the way through. You looked so strong. Tell me a little bit though, because I've got a running shoe review channel where shoe nerds. Yes. And on this channel, we're very much <laughs> tilted towards the meta speed sky we love it tell us what you ran in today well you're not the only one obviously as an asics athlete like i've been testing this prototype the meta speed prototype for the last year it's coming out soon follow for more and you'll be able to find out awesome oh man such a teaser we <laughs> wish we could learn more but we'll have to wait on that um the next thing i want to ask you about and i don't want to take too much of your time because you're yeah. celebrating today yes. for making the team usa one of the things that you talked about ahead of this race was your goal would be to be able to cross the finish line making the team with your training partner and friend yes. uh connor mance yeah. what was that like for you and tell me a little bit about like the uh there was a little bit of no you go no you go tell me a little bit about that <laughs> yeah i uh obviously mad respects and uh for my friend for sure first and foremost and training partner connor mance you know, he works hard day in and day out, and so it just felt so incredible. You know, we've visualized and planned for this day for months and months, and I, I, I can't believe that it happened. It's like a dream uh, to break away from the field and to finish one too. Um, yeah, what happened that last couple hundred meters? Well, I, I, you could just say that I just wanted to enjoy it and soak it in more than he did. He, he wasn't feeling too hot, and he just wanted to finish the race. And, uh, you know, so a couple miles out, I took the lead, and he said, yeah, take the lead. And I, I just wanted to carry him as far as I could to the finish line and enjoy that with him. Uh, I know that I will be far better in Paris with him by my side, uh, no matter the result that happened today. And I, I wanted him to make it to that finish line and, and to soak it in with me. And so that's what we did. What a great way to carry through and bring up the people that you've been training with and working Thank with you. that I'm sure has helped you along the way as Thank well. Thank you. The last thing I want to ask you about today is you talked a little bit about family when you came yes, into this yeah. ASICS after party. Yes. You talked a lot about your family. Um, as someone myself who has two daughters, yeah. tell me about what it was like for you to have your children there at the finish line. Yeah. And what do you hope that they see and remember from this event, which they're very young, yeah. so they might not remember <laughs> anything. But what, what is the one thing that you hope that they'll oh, bring man. out from this? Oh, man. Yeah, so my girls, Lucy and Jenna, they're five and three. And, and Lucy, that's she's five. You know, it's just getting to the age where she's, she's starting to understand what a race is all about. And so for a week straight, she's been asking me, is tomorrow the race? Is tomorrow the race? Is tomorrow the race? And, you know, the race finally came and what a pleasure it was to like cross the finish line and then immediately see them. And to just try to instill in them just for a moment how precious it was. I'm so grateful for all the media that captured that moment. So that way, you know, in a year or two or three or for years to come, like we can relive that with them and they can understand that they were part of this, um, that they kept me grounded when, you know, life kind of gets busy and you get too hyper-focused on running, that, you know, life is much more than just crossing a finish line that, that I could focus on, you know, I know it's about my girls, it's about my wife, Ashley, and uh, it was it was priceless. Well, what a great celebration Thank you. of the sacrifices that your family has made and the team around you has made to get you to where you are. I feel like you have done them justice. And Sacrifice I'm sure is an understatement, but uh, I, I hope that they can see a little glimpse into, you know, what the sacrifice now has brought. Awesome. Well, I can't wait to see the progress from here yeah. to Paris, and I look forward to the next part of the journey. Appreciate it. See you in Paris.